The fact that we have the after headquarters in Accra, does that mean anything? Does oh, it put us in major, any advantage? Major significant. Is it not just a bureaucratic headquarters that we have in Accra? How does it really the work? The symbolism of it is very, very important. Mm. In the sense that, okay, this is a country that since 2017 has been growing at an average of 7%. That's world leading. Mm -hmm. I mean, last year, um, and maybe this year, the IMF and the World Bank projected that Ghana will be, again, one of the fastest growing economies in the world. And then suddenly it's announced that, oh, you are headquarters of the AFCFTA. Mm. That is great testimony that there's a confidence in you to lead the African economic and financial renaissance mm -hmm. by bringing in investment for trade. And bear in mind, Africa's story is now different from what it was 30 years ago. If you look at the 10 fastest economies in the world today, seven are from Africa. That means Africa is ready. Um, but there's still a lot to do. We need to formulate that architecture that we have in Ghana right into Africa because it's working. It's worked for us. If someone mm -hmm. were to come and invest in Africa, mm -hmm. East Africa seems to be the place they love to go the most because the environment there is conducive. If they are supposed to move from East Africa, they want to go to South Africa mm -hmm. before they even think of West Africa. And even if they come to West Africa, Nigeria has the biggest economy. We clearly are just punching above our weight, but maybe we may have an after headquarters, but that's where it ends. But don't you want to punch above your weight? I'd really like to suck a good heavyweight punch, although I'm not heavy mm -hmm. heavyweight. <laughs> I mean, I like to give it because, yeah. yes, it's important. Mm -hmm. But you have to recognize that Ghana, despite Nigeria's size, Ghana has been voted as the most attractive investment destination in West Africa. To the extent that I remember the previous uh, uh, Nigerian administration, uh, I heard one minister once got up in the cabinet and said, this small Ghana, this small Ghana self, did mm -hmm. it get more foreign direct mm -hmm. investment than we mm -hmm. are? Now, this is something that we didn't say ourselves. It was said by the World Bank that in 2018, Ghana was the most attractive place to invest in West Africa. And if you look at the, the, I mean, the accolades we've gotten over the past three, four mm -hmm. years, mm -hmm. it tells you that there's something really positive happening. There's we a new direction.